and welcome to December 18th. And today's story is called Snow Puppies. And it is all about the 101 Dalmatians, which is one of my favorite movies and reminds me of my cute little puppies. The Dalmatian puppies were confused. A few days earlier, Roger had brought a treat into the house and hung sparkly balls on it. Now, Manny was putting some boxes with bows beneath the tree. What is she doing? Patch asked his parents, Pongo and Perdita. Why, it's Christmas, Perdita said. Humans give presents at Christmas to show what they, that they care about each other, Pongo explained. Let's give our humans a present, Lucky said. I know just what to give them, Rolly shouted, excited. He ran off and fetched his best bone. Roger and Anita will love it. Lucky laughed. Humans don't chew bones, silly, he said. Later on their afternoon walk, the puppies saw a group of children playing in the snow. As Lucky watched the children, he smiled. He knew just what to get their humans. When they returned home, Lucky started digging in the snow. Watch me and do what I do, he told his siblings. The other puppies watched as Lucky made a giant snowball. Slowly, he began to dig out a puppy shape in the snow. The puppies grinned. Lucky was right. This was the perfect gift. All afternoon, the little Dalmatians dug and rolled and scooped and scraped snow into little snow puppy shapes. Freckles, Patch, and Penny found sticks for tails. Rolly found coal for the snow puppies' eyes and noses. But the snow puppies still didn't seem right. There's something missing, Lucky said. Suddenly, Lucky noticed a, t a trail of black paw prints leading from the coal shed across the snow yard. That's it. Our snow puppies need spots, he shouted. Rub your paws in the coal dust, Lucky told the others. Then you can put black spots on the snow puppies. The puppies ran into the coal shed. Then they bounded over to the snow puppies, working Busily, the Dalmatians covered their creations with tons of black spots. Soon it was time for the snow puppies to go back inside. After dinner, Nana read the puppies a Christmas story and tucked them into bed. The puppies were so excited that they wiggled and giggled for a long time. Finally, they fell fast asleep. On Christmas morning, Roger, Anita, and Nanny gave the puppies their gifts. Each one got a rubber ball, a bone, and a nice new red sweater. The puppies loved the presents, but they couldn't wait any longer to give their, give their own. Lucky ran to the door and began to bark. I think they want us to follow them, Roger said. When they stepped outside, Roger and Anita began to cheer. In their front yard sat 101 beautiful Dalmatian snow puppies. Nanny laughed so hard she sat down right in the snow. Why, that's 101 of the best Christmas gifts I've ever gotten, she said, hugging as many puppies as she could hold. And everyone agreed that it was so. As you can see, they make cute little snow puppies out of snow. And sadly, it's not snowing here in Illinois right now, but... I hope that when it does snow that you get to enjoy some of that beautiful snow and that beautiful weather outside with your families, maybe even making a snow puppy or a snowman. All right, see you soon.